Sir Ken Robinson talked about how schools kill creativity. Schools tell students that if they don't know the answer, then they're dumb. Part about being well-educated is knowing how to find the answer. Multiple choice tests kill creativity. In the real world, you won't have the answers right in front of you. You're going to think of all the possible solutions, and that's what makes people think outside of the box. The school curriculum has way too many rules. It doesn't allow teachers, professors, and students to be creative. For example, if a teacher tells his or her students to draw a vase, you might get a few pictures that are really creative and out of the ordinary. However, the vast majority of them will look similar. If you tell students they can draw whatever they want to, then you're going to get students to think outside of the box. When students actually care about what they're working on, they'll work harder on it. They don't really care about drawing a vase, but they do care about drawing something they picked. Robinson said, Creativity now is as important in education as literacy. If you think about it, creativity is important in every field. You have to be creative to come up with the solution. It's important in business when you're selling products and coming up with formulas in math and science and defending your case in court if you're a lawyer, and etc. Teachers and professors should ask questions that spark creativity. It will also get everyone in the classroom to bond. And here are some examples. What's your favorite shape and why? What would you throw off an eight-story building? If you could be anywhere in the world right now, where would it be and why? And what makes you happy? Thanks for watching. This message, this message was brought to you by Restoring the Meaning of Education. Email us at rme2011 at yahoo.com.